All right, hey, what is up, guys? My name is Eric. I'm Pretty Ghost Gamers, and we are back playing Cube Two. Um, this is really fun game. Um, I was very, very actually excited to start doing this episode, um, mainly just because. Oh man, that was a long drop. There goes our altitude that we were trying to get. Emma, I've emerged into a large chamber. Can you tell me how far I am from the beacon? Your altitude shows that you're about halfway there. There's a strange Whoa, machine here. We're halfway here. there. I'm going to investigate it. See if it can help me find my way around this place. Okay, let's uh, let's investigate this then. Let's interact with that. I can't decipher this, Emma. The language is like nothing I've ever seen. There are some things I can make out in illustration. Like, it seems to be a physical transportation machine. What? The an language is like nothing I've ever seen. Why are you, why are you speaking twice? Stop. It's connected to the three doorways by these large cables. I wonder if it's something that can be powered, taking us towards the beacon. Um, okay. So how do... What is that? I, I have oh. no idea. But Green. whatever it was, it seems to have turned this machine on, and it's opened one of the doors. What are you going to do? There we go. I'm going to follow this cable and find out what this machine does. Follow the blue Be cable. Careful, so, there's two secret achievements that I know of. Um, and I plan on getting both of them. Um, and then hopefully I'll finish this within like two to three parts. Um, and if I do that, uh, things will be golden. And I, I don't know what chapter I'm on. Oh, hey, there we go. I'm on chapter five. Um, and I think it was... I think it was this chapter and the next chapter are where are like Emma, the easiest you places you can do the the secret achievements. The signals a lot better now. Good. I found what these cables are connected to. It looks like a power reactor. Do you think you can power it? Is nope. it safe? I don't know if it's safe for sure, but it certainly does something. There are four doorways connected to it by cables. One of them seems accessible. The door behind me is also locked, so it doesn't seem like I have much choice. Okay. Follow All right, the well. cable through the open door and see if there's a power so source connected to here. it or a way to open these other rooms. Got it. Okay, what what door do I go through then? Because I see no open doors. Because that's not open. Maybe it's this one? Yeah, it's this one. Alright. Um, please don't tell me we're going downstairs again. Alright, I guess we are. Cool. Okay. Um It looks like these cables lead through to more rooms. I'm gonna follow them. See if they connect to anything that can help power that central machine. Good idea. Let me know if you find anything useful. Um, what does this do? Oh, that's what that does. Cool. Cool. There's nothing there that will help me get across. Destroy that one. Run across. Okay, so that just stays the, like like that. Um, that's not what I want. I want that one. Okay, what does this do? That moves that over there. And that moves that over there. Cool. So I'll just do this. I've got to destroy that. Nice. Watch me miss. I missed. <laughs> Oops. Uh, 
Oops. I missed. Again. I shouldn't have rushed that one. That was my bad. So, yeah, from what I understand, there's four achievements that are technically missable. And, uh, I mean, one of them is, like, two of them are story related, it's just two different endings. At least that's from entirely of stuff that I have read. I don't know what that just did. Was it that? Yes, it was that. What does this do? That does that one. Um, so I guess we'll do that and that. And that did not help me at all. Oops. Oh, you know what? Bam. Now I can get this one. And hopefully this is just a... Okay, so that is just a push one. Um, and I'm gonna take a guess and say that needs to go there. That needs to go there. And that needs to go there. Bam. Look at that. I'm so smart. I don't know what's on this other side, but... I've not seen this technology before. I wonder what it does. It's a sand. I guess I'll just jump into it. Oh, that's what that does. Okay. I was gonna say, hopefully the fan doesn't kill me. Fans are cool, yo. I'm gonna take a guess I need to do this. So I can stay behind the fan. Or, well, stay out of the way of the fan, otherwise it's gonna push me. Look at that! We're just gonna blaze through this entire game like it's nothing. Um. Actually, let's do this one instead, because you can jump from that. Oh, you know, I think that's what I was probably supposed to do in, uh, what I, what I didn't do in episode one. Was find somewhere to jump off better from. What does that do? Nothing. You know, I feel like this is actually the introduction of, uh, of the yellow switch, of the yellow cube. Oh! There we go. What 
do you do? I'm dumb. I'm real dumb. <laughs> I'm, I'm real dumb. Uh... There we go. That took me a lot longer than that should have. <laughs> I also like how when I said that, it was right after I said, oh, we're going to blaze through Emma, this. That cable is connected to a terminal. It seems to have sent some form of energy back to that reactor and unlocked the other doors in this room. I'm going to check it out and follow the other cables attached to the reactor. Let's see what's behind these doors. Maybe you're onto something here, Millie. Report All right. Changes. So let's go through this one. So we can try and figure out how to do other things not correctly. Okay. So that's what that does. That does that. So I'm going to need... I'm going to need one of those there. One of those there. I'm going to need to push this. Like so. And then jump. Like so. And... Will this crush that? I think it will. Oh, no, but it's pretty damn close. Oh! I'm dumb. There we go. Did a lot better on that one. Okay, so first off, let's find out what this does. That moves that, got it. Okay, that's going to be a pain in the ass. Because I'm going to have to jump up there. This one's first. So I'm going to do this first. And I'm going to do that. Okay, this one's not too bad. And okay, so this one was a lot better than the last room that we just did. So there's that. Okay, let's go to this room now. And hopefully I actually did the hardest one of the ones first. Or not. Okay, so what do you do? You move that from one side to the other. Cool. And you move that from one side to the other. Oh, and you know what? It's probably that, that right there is probably a conveyor belt. So I'm going to need... I'm going to need that there, and that there, and drop that to right there. And that, yep. Okay. 
so I need to find a way on how to get Oh, you know what? Duh. That's a good way to do that. Nailed it. Room's not as hard as I thought it would be. What does this do? Okay, so I think that's permanently up. So now I don't have to do that again. That's good. Okay. So now I want that like that that out come on there we go this like that this like that now i'm just gonna do another cube just because i can okay that one super easy that one's the easiest one of all of them oh good more fans just what i'm good at Okay, so what do you do? You move those like that. And... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So I want that one like that. I want that one like that. I'm gonna drop that. I'm gonna do that. Push that. <coughs> and then do that. Boom! Okay. So now I need that one right there, that to go on top of that, that to go up, except for I need to do this now. in front of this. That. Bam. What is that? I think whatever you're doing in there is having an effect on the greater structure. Ooh. I hope it's a good thing. This reactor seems to be fully powered and is sending something back to that machine. I'm gonna check it out. All right, cool. So now we're going back to that big room. This is probably the longest chapter because you gotta do three rooms for one item. But I'm thinking each room might be a chapter, kind of like how Octodad did stuff. I don't know. It's, it's That one's kind of hard to explain. So, we did this one, which means it should be somewhat powered. Emma, from what I can tell, this machine is powered by a third, and another door connected to it has opened. How fascinating. Okay, Millie, I trust your judgment. Let's see if it actually works as you think when all thirds are powered. I'm on it. So now we're on to the second room of three. Because, you know, all games work in the rules of, thir of three, naturally. Mm. Another reactor. First We're on powered. chapter six. So I was right. Um. And that's where I need to go. There is a room in this that you can just immediately, uh, <clears throat> you can immediately go through 
and get one of the achievements here, and I know it involves breaking one of the green blocks. There we go. Um, and it's probably one of the last doors, to be completely honest. I have I seen what these are used for. The, the video on needing to do that. Unless if I completely missed out on it. And also I'm going to... Okay, so that was good practice, because that is one of the other achievements that you have to do. I'm gonna... Yep. So, I'm just gonna go like that. I'm gonna launch myself over to this one. <clears throat> I'm gonna put that back and then rotate it so I can do that and then launch myself again you know some of these puzzles really aren't that difficult and I'm pretty sure the last one that I just did is gonna be kind of infuriating uh, okay so what does this one do that does that Drop that, we'll drop that. Oh, oh, I almost missed that. <laughs> so I jump on top of this. And now I'm pretty sure I need to do that again. So it flies over me onto that one. Yeah, oh, and that goes up too. That goes up too, I didn't know that. I get the feeling I'm gonna have to turn that one again. Yep. Natural laws of physics, I knew it. Emma, can I ask you a question? No. What would you like to know? Nothing. So many things are running through my mind. I mean, you were sent to destroy that extraterrestrial object, right? Sometimes. I was, as were many. So. How did we develop this manipulation technology? We tracked the vessel for years since it entered the solar system, intercepting signals from it, decoding them. We learned about its structure, but not its host. And you used this data to what? Develop this technology I'm wearing? It was going to kill everyone on Earth, Millie. It was an invasion. Sorry. I just... I just need to orient myself. That's all. You've got to admit, this situation is somewhat out of the ordinary. I know. This journey, it's not what I expected either, Millie. Can I? Really? Okay. I'm gonna take a guess. I just get on that then? Uh, okay. I was going to try jumping on that, but I don't think that would have worked. Okay, so now if I do this... Oh, what? Okay, I wasn't even trying to get that achievement, but that works. Okay. Okay. I understand now. I understand now. So I've got to launch that. Yep, onto that. And then I have to launch myself onto that. I'm do this. Well, cool. That was uh, that was one of the secret achievements uh, that I was definitely not actually trying to do. What does this do? This is a fan. Got it. Okay, so I think I'm supposed to go angled. 
Maybe I can just do it off this. Nope. Can't. Do this. And then drop in. And then pop out. And I'll have to do this. Drop in. Pop out. Got it. That was a really easy one. What am I stuck on? The door. I got stuck on the door. Oh, hey. Okay, so this is this is the room that you're supposed to do the do that achievement in, where you do that, that, and that. You launch yourself onto this. Do that right there. Do that right there. And then you're supposed to hit that one so that it launches you up at the very top. Like, like so is what they told me is you have to be at the very edge, hit this one, jump, and as long as you hit that top one, you're good. Across that bridge. Jumpy. <clears throat> that room really wasn't that difficult either. Oh, this is going to be another uh, achievement. No, I don't think it's humane to knock her away. She needs medical attention and she needs to be looked after. You don't know what you're dealing with, James? So just do me a favor and drop the management. Shit. Um, I think once we finish this room. Okay, let's power these other rooms. Okay, so we're gonna put this as a as a stopping point for right now. Um, so that was part two. Um, there will definitely be more. Because I, I want to get to the end of this and might as well do it while I'm recording. So, uh, this will be a small series. It won't be as long as, of course, the Fallout 1 or anything else like that. Um, or any other ones that I plan on doing because I haven't planned on one yet. Um, <clears throat> anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. At the end of the video, there will be a playlist for uh, Cube. And then there will be another playlist for Fallout for you guys to watch, or I'll just have them pop up, like, right now as I'm speaking. Um, and while you're at it, while you guys are contemplating about going through those, go ahead, give a like and a subscribe, and hit that bell notification so that you know when this game will continue or when Fallout continues or when any other games or any other videos that I will do will show up. So... Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.